here. We're here to take your daughters from the home due to find This is how many children enter the foster care system in the United States, forcibly taken from an abusive home. Is your name Henry? Yeah, why? Were you under arrest? Hey, oh, man, you got the For others, it may be due to a parent's death, or in the case of Naquana Clark, a parent's drug addiction. Uh, when they came, she was like, all right, well, get some of your stuff. And I didn't know what to take. I'm like, where am I going? <laughs> what to take? <laughs> if she's not, my mom's not going, it was just me and my brother. Get up, Juice. In all cases, it's a real life drama. Here played out in a movie called Know How by actors who've lived through it. We're going to be doing screenings of the films. The film is a product of the Possibility Project, run by Paul Griffin. For years, he's been teaching theater to underprivileged kids as a tool for their own empowerment. But after staging a play based on the experiences of foster children, he saw an opportunity. The impact on audience was overwhelming, and we heard that from our audiences. They were felt like they were learning something that they had never seen before, which was a surprise to us. We just didn't see that coming. Eddie, you are very intelligent. And all you have to do is pass the test. The different storylines in the film illustrate hard facts. Only 50% of American children in foster care finish high school, and 60% are convicted of a crime. The film took three years to realize, and a major commitment from a group of young people still struggling to get their own lives under control. Now they're showing it not only at film festivals, but also to the agencies and social workers in charge of children in foster care. For many in the cast, working on the project was the first time they openly talked about their experiences. None of us think that we're going to go off and be like the next Denzel, the next Halle Berry, you know what I mean? We were doing it because it was like, this is important to tell these stories. Their ultimate goal is to improve foster care and provide a happy ending for more children in the system. Kristen Salumi, Al Jazeera, New York.